Yo, what's good everybody? It's your boy SBX and I want to do a video topic on pretty much both physical and verbal abuse when it comes to relationships. Now, despite the fact that this has been going on for many years and also the fact that it also occurs to other people's families, not saying everybody and their family don't uh, experience both physical and uh, verbal abuse. Now, I don't really like how this generation of people mistreat their spouse. Of course, women like to be known for the victims of being abused by their boyfriends or husbands even family members like mothers and fathers and stuff like that but um i'm going towards relationship wise you know uh it's like i said it's wrong to always hit a woman it's very wrong to hit a woman and i figure that this is really a painful feeling now the reason why women are stuck to these type of relationships I would say in a positive view, but at the same time, y'all may not or may agree to what I'm going to say, but like I said, this is my opinion, and I'm using my observations to know why women do these things. Like, okay, like well, it goes back to the bad boy theories, you know? It goes back to where girls go around with bad boys because they're exciting and they always get what they want and have that princess type of mentality. Sometimes an asshole, a bad boy, or whatever, anybody between a thug or just your normal asshole who ain't shit, a punk or whatever, feel like, okay, a woman is easy to, not only to manipulate, but damage her because nine out of 10 women are just you know, I'm not saying all women, but it's like women are easily emotional and also you can break them physically and also mentally. But like I said, it's it's not all about all it's not all women, but just those. The ones that look weak and act weak, they will do their advantage. The men will do their advantage of doing that to women. So it's all depends on what type of guy they search so like i said the reason why a lot of women are always into those type of guys it goes back to their mindset of thinking oh you know he's so sexy oh he's so cool he did this he's such a bad boy i love that but then years later or once you're in a relationship you realize and you regret being with this guy because he does these things for to you you know what I'm saying? He smacks you around. If you don't tell him what you want, he'll threaten you to do stuff to you and blah, 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 etc., etc. Like I said, it's not a good feeling to have somebody to hit you, but they so called love you. That's not real. That's not love right there. You know what I mean? Somebody's going to beat the shit out of you, uh, use a object, like, you know, he'll use a, a a rope or maybe a belt or any object stuff like that that's just that's just wrong in many ways and also raping as well because this is the reason why a lot of women are a little a bit skeptical with guys is because no woman wants to deal with a relationship that is all about abuse and and being mistreated verbally and physically and being lied to and manipulated you know and like i said that's not real love i mean like i said a lot of times men are the ones who are doing this to the relationship being a woman i'm not saying all oh, assholes assholes are the ones who are doing that if it's not cheating then he's just beating your ass because you don't give him this demand like what you see on the maury show you see how these women are afraid to confront today 
husbands or boyfriends or do things that they want to do is because the men are are not only assholes but they're insecure because of the fact that if they if, if one thing leads to the next if a woman let's say did something wrong and she's not being consistent then the man will go angry and just beat the shit out of this woman because she's so-called thinks she's a bitch and blah 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 or he fucked it up and she's just not getting the whole concept of doing things then get mad okay but let's be real sometimes men will do the same thing too and women will regret and be mad about that but anywho it's not always men always the abusers women are too but they're sly and sneaky and clever with it. there are some times that women are abusing their boyfriends or husbands because of their selfish and insecure needs now most of the times when it comes to that situation women will get away from that type of abuse given toward their men than men doing it to women of course society doesn't really believe that women are abusing and manipulating their men just because okay they're beautiful and they're you know they're women and blah 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 they want to stick to their lives you know what I mean men are always provoked all the time by their girlfriends and stuff like that but we use our morals and what mom or dad or what anybody say us men we can't hit a woman because it's wrong it's not the right thing but to be honest though some men including me when a woman really piss you off and she hits you all the time and disrespecting you you, you really want to slap a bitch because so, it's because it's, let's be real i'm not saying oh we should just have a movement to just say fuck it let's beat our women up because they're bitches but just in in in, in, in psychological view most of the times when a man slapped the hell out of a woman like you know out of nowhere now that's just that depends on a woman but if a woman thinks she, she can control you and she can't do a damn thing but once you got the once you you know get your sh get mad and upset and next thing you know you want to take charge to a woman just slap the shit out of her she's gonna think twice of course you're gonna say oh you know i'm sorry i didn't mean to do that oh you hit me you know you're best blah 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 some women that's all but some women will know not to fuck with you again but in the day it's like you got it it's like sometimes men will use that type of fear towards women to make them think okay you can't fuck with me but then again women will do the same thing to the men it's like that's how it is you know but like I said I think women who abuse their men is wrong as well and society and the legal system should observe to that thing you know if a, if a, if a mother who abused their child because of her selfish and crazy bizarre ways then a, then a woman should be charged for abuse and domestic violence against her husband and plead guilty for it and go to jail and pay for the hospital bills and etc but it doesn't go like this in modern generation especially modern America it doesn't because like I said women get away from everything and then not only that men have to suffer everything that we have to deal just to fight for equality again this is another thing that feminism just want us to dwell with it's just bullshit petty double standards this is the reason why a lot of men are the big bad wolf but then we want to give our serious and generous and loving side to the wrong bitch that we still fucked up just because and it's like there's no consideration for both men and women so like i said yes i believe it's wrong to hit a woman but at the same time it's wrong to hit a man either fucking way on both genders of men women boys and girls we should not hit put our hands on each other no matter how pissed off we are you know what i'm saying and this is why 
in this society and what we deal with love is not going nowhere because we don't know how to respect each other. If you love somebody, why would you hit somebody? It's like, do you love your mom? Do you love your dad? Do you love your clothes? Do you love your animals? When you when you do that, when you hit when you abuse that, then how do you love them? Of course, it's different when you do that to your kids. But that's another way of discipline. But at the same time, you're dealing with adults. You're dealing with somebody who is not inferior to you. That's the whole concept of life. Is you know abusing people, abusing what you have, and over abusing. Well, abusing period. It's just not right. It's not love. It's not respecting and and, and admiring things and doing things that is consistent. There's no consistency at all when you abuse a man and also provoke a man to hit you and not only that also abusing a woman and both genders it's just wrong either fucking way either fucking way you know what i'm saying it, it doesn't matter how emotional you are i don't care if you have a bad day you don't put that frustration on any fucking body a man or woman doesn't matter how pissed off this person is you should never leave your leg not even reconsider to to put your hands on that man or that woman people need to realize that we all need to learn what's the whole definition and true perspectives of equality this is what's wrong with america there's no equality this is a double standard that both genders want to idolize because of their female and male um, type of ways they feel like okay I want to be inferior and it doesn't go that way it shouldn't go this way it's all about how you treat how you want to be treated treat somebody how you want to be treated that's the whole concept of life is to treat people how you want to be treated if you treat them good, they will treat you back. If they can't treat you good, then you can't fuck with them. Of course, you want to take um, action, but at the same time, use your action wisely. You know what I'm saying? Two wrongs don't make a right. As much as we want to kick somebody's ass, it's still not the right way. Fight for love, not for bullshit. Do it the right way. Anyways, peoples. Uh, let me know what y'all think on this topic. You know what I'm saying? If y'all experience type that that type of situation with a, a loved one or you deal with this one or it was a past relationship you deal with, please uh, leave a comment and also subscribe to my channel. So anyways, people, I'm out and see you next time. Peace.